Hi, I'm Julie Hallam. I'm one of the senior development officers at Hightown. I'm across the road from Hightown House at our screen at Heart of Maylands Phase 2, which is the second phase of our Heart of Maylands development. And we'll deliver 158 affordable new homes and three commercial units. Just in terms of a bit of history of the site, the site was previously owned by a company called 66 Books, which are a book wholesaler, and they were on site for about 20 years before we acquired the site in 2019. Demolition of the site uh, happened in 2020, at the same time that we submitted the planning application. And after securing planning in 2020, we tendered the works contract in early 2021 and um, Hill Partnerships successfully was successfully appointed um, in July 21 and works formally started on site in October 21. The scheme comprises 158 new homes for affordable rent and shared ownership. 26 of these are houses which are located at the rear of the site and 132 apartments are split across four blocks which are currently labelled A, B, C and D. There will also be a new public right-of-way um, installed alongside Block D, which is the tower where I'm standing. The, uh, the postal address for the whole development has been confirmed as Juniper Square. Hello, I'm Alison Lang. I'm Head of Projects in the development team at Hightown. Um, we're now in one of our houses um, and we're just going to talk to you about the construction. The scheme is built as traditional construction of brick and block and the uh, flats are all made out of concrete. Um, we have a fabric first approach to our developments which means we inclu increase the insulation in order to lower our residents' energy bills. This is our first scheme of 100% um, air source heat pumps which will provide the heating for the development. As you can see in this building, um, we've got underfloor heating rather than traditional radiators. We're now outside Block D in the main Mainlands Plaza. The first homes are due to hand over in January and the rest of them will be all finished by January 2024.